Good evening, I'm Claudine Ewing. In 2015, Ulysses Wingo won over voters in the Maston District in Buffalo. And since then, he served as a member of the Buffalo Common Council. I am not running for re-election. And that is because I have been given an offer by an organization to do the work that I am doing right now on a more in personal level. There was a collective gasp in the room when Councilman Wingo announced that one of his most difficult and yet fulfilling jobs will come to an end at the end of the year. Voters will elect someone new. Keep it classy. Keep it clean. Be respectful. Run an honorable campaign. Who will fill the Maston District seat. As of today, only India Walton has publicly announced she's running. She was at the Maston District breakfast when Wingo made his announcement. I spoke with her briefly. I spoke with him last week for a good hour, and he said that he was running again, so I don't know what changed between now and then, but um, I, I think that it's a good decision, um, and there's time to make way for new ideas. Another potential candidate is Zanetta Everhart, mother of a 514 top shooting victim and lifelong Maston District resident. She was also at the breakfast and spoke briefly about her work with the state senator. Yes, I'm a hometowner. <laughs> um. <laughs> Councilman Wingo joined me at Channel 2 a few hours after his announcement. We haven't seen a woman on the council in so long. India Walton, Zanetta Everhart, if mm. she decides that she's going to jump into this race, will one of them get your endorsement? Yes, one of them will uh, receive my endorsement later on after they've shown the community uh, what they can do, what things they're going to bring to the community and to the residents. For now, he's focused on getting things done, including ShotSpotter. My main focus is to make sure that ShotSpotter is up and running six months later, make sure that we have the information ready, that we can publish to the community. We can have this discourse and discuss what is happening with the data, how it affects us, how it does not affect us, what we can do to decrease the uh, instances of shots fired in the city of Buffalo. And Wingo says we will learn very soon about his new job, but he is not able to share that news just yet.